They can only Terms like quarks, neutrinos, and antimatter may not mean anything to you. But for Hamilton this, uh, seniors like Cassandra Dietrich, they're the building blocks to understanding what holds our world together. She's one of four students to take the school's first ever physics master class. Most I enjoy the experiments that we do and like learning how different things work. Mm -hmm. Students here are learning about the microscopic particles that actually make up protons Inside and neutrons. There. Teacher Darwin Smith says those tiny materials make up the mass of everything in the world. I think it's especially important for students in a small school because they can see a whole world of possibilities that you won't see in an area like ours and so they get to see some things that are out there. Students are performing hands-on experiments and even working with data from the 17-mile-long Hadron Collider in Switzerland, which is leading research into the basic laws of physics. While these teenagers are meeting with some of the best of the world's leading scientists via video conferencing, they may not become physicists later in life. But no matter their future, they're learning skills for a lifetime. One thing they take away a better understanding of, of the research that's going on in particle physics and research in general they learn about using indirect evidence to figure out things about how materials are put together. It challenges me and I'm better prepared for college. Dietrich plans to be a math teacher, but it's classes like this that are giving her a view into what makes the world go round, literally. Melissa Shriver, KHQA News, Hamilton.